Michael Jackson abused us hundreds of times Two men have told the BBC they were abused hundreds of times by Michael Jackson from the ages of 7 and 10. Wade Robson, 36, told the BBC's Victoria Derbyshire program the singer had sexually abused him from the age of 7 and tried to rape him when he was 14. James Safechuck, 40, told the program Jackson had sexually abused him from the age of 10 until around 14. Jackson's family say there's not one piece of evidence to prove the claims. The two men have also spoken out in the documentary Leaving Neverland. Warning, this article contains descriptions some may find offensive or upsetting asked if the abuse had occurred hundreds and hundreds of times, both Mr. Robson and Mr. Safechuck agreed that this had been the case. Mr. Robson told the program, every time I was with him, every time I stayed the night with him, he abused me. Jackson had fondled him, touching my entire body, and made him watch the singer performing a sex act, he said. And then, when he was 14, Jackson had tried to rape him. Show our love, that was one of the last sexual abuse experiences we had, Mr. Robson told the program. Jackson had groomed him to believe they loved each other, and this is how we show our love, he said. And then he would immediately follow that up with, but if anybody else ever found out what we are doing, you and I would go to jail for the rest of our lives, and our lives would fall apart, he and I would fall apart, Mr. Robson told the program. All of this was terrifying to me. The idea of being pulled away from Michael, this man, this otherworldly figure, this god to me who had now become my best friend, no way was I going to do anything that would pull me away from him. Michael Jackson doc director challenges cult of celebrity Jackson doc is disturbing and devastating Channel 4 rejects Jackson estate complaint over documentary Mr. Robson said Jackson had told him I was his best friend and the only person he had ever done these sexual acts with. So therefore I was, out of all the boys in the world, the chosen one, I thought, he said. Mr. Safechuck told the program his abuse had begun with Jackson teaching him how to perform a sex act at the age of 10. Then you start French kissing, he said I taught him how to do that, Mr. Safechuck said. And this had been followed by further abuse and other sex acts. Find out more Watch the Victoria Derbyshire program's full interview with Wade Robson and James Safechuck from 10 o'clock GMT on BBC2 and the BBC News Channel in the UK. Mr. Safechuck told the program Jackson had been able to abuse him over such a sustained period of time because he had also successfully groomed his parents. There's a long grooming process where Michael inserts himself into your family and becomes a part of your family, he said. It takes him a while to build up the trust, it doesn't happen overnight. And he then makes a wedge between you and your parents.